Hey, uh, welcome to a new episode of Building a System, or it's a tech system of the day. Let's see, what are we going to call this? I didn't know what we need to call this. I think I'm going to put it up here. System build of the day and the price. Uh, this system build today will be the cheapest. You could probably go a little cheaper, but I don't know how much more. I wouldn't go too much cheaper because this one is bare bones in a sense. It is an operating computer. It can play a minimum of some games. Nothing that really crazy. It does come with a monitor and everything for $550. The only thing we did not include was the operating system. And the reason for that is there are so many sites to go to to buy a license key. Uh, I just, I just when I was researching it, I was just like, hey, I don't know. I upgraded mine. Uh, and some of you guys probably won't know how to do that or don't want to do it. And so you're going to want to buy the uh, license uh, from Microsoft. Download it from Microsoft and buy it yourself or get it on a DVD, which you can easily do from these websites we'll show you, for about $110. So if you include the operating system, it's about $660. It does include a 1080p monitor, two hard drives, uh, everything, um, minus a mouse and keyboard. Uh, you can normally get a mouse and keyboard for $14. We'll add that into the next episode that we do if this is uh, something people like. Again, so let's start with our show here. Uh, it's... build uh, the cheapest you could get that can still play some games you know you could still it's like anything else you can do Adobe Premiere in this but your render times are not going to be great but say you got something to do you do your videos you hit render or export and you go do something and come back an hour later and your 20 minute video is uh, exported so it'll definitely work so starting off we'll start off with the processor you got to have a processor to make it work in AMD AMD makes good processors. They make a cheaper processor. Uh, this is not the cheapest one they make, but we wanted to keep it in the line of something that would work, uh, something that's not so outdated that you would uh, be um, like 10 years behind. So you'll be like five years behind. Okay, the processor, AMD A10, which built-in graphics. That's how we cut down some of the cost there. 7700K. It's a quad-core, 3.4 gigahertz. It will... Uh, turbo up to 3.6 to 3.8. One of the things is I do not recommend overclocking this system uh, just because we are buying a cheaper uh, fan for it because we're trying to save cost. If you go with the water cool with this system, which would cost you probably another $100, $60 to $100, you could overclock it a little bit, but it's not, guys, it's not going to be worth that. This is for the guy that just wants to play some games, get into it. Um, he's got an old copy of Adobe Premiere and he wants to add that to it and all and uh, this is that system so gets high marks from uh, new egg as you see here and it's ninety four dollars and ninety nine cents it does include free shipping so that was one of the reasons we picked it and it's a radon r7 so it's the seven version of or the 700 version of radon uh, it's not bad but it's you know again it's the low end of the totem pole uh, reviews are great here's uh, all the specifics on it nothing major nothing fancy nothing to make you write home about that's the processor so let's go to the fan. All right, so a lot of you are freaking out about this fan. Yes, guys, I get it. You can spend $10 more and get a better fan, but we're going to the lowest cost that will work. This is ultra quiet. The reviews on it were pretty good on Newegg, uh, but we're going to order it from a different company uh, or a different vendor because it's free shipping. Newegg wanted $5.99 for shipping. This is free shipping. This is uh, super biz. Uh, again, the link will be in the description. Um, it's nine dollars and forty-nine cents. You can't beat that. Again, guys, this is not for overclocking. This is get your bare bones system running. Maybe this is for your kid. And you want to build it and enjoy it, but you want your kid to be able to watch Netflix and do a couple other things. All right, so we got the CPU and the fan. Now we need the motherboard. So what's the motherboard? Well, we chose an ASUS uh, FM2 AMD um, socket. And as you can see, it's only $48.99. So, well, that's, you know, that's crazy. Uh, it got fairly okay reviews, but again, we're looking at the bare bones. Um, this one has two, three USB ports. I like that. It has uh, a total of two on the back of USB 2.0s. So your mouse and your keyboard are going to take those. 
uh, that's going to kind of suck. So your 3.0 ports are going to be left up for your other items. Now, the, uh, the motherboard does have uh, other USB ports that you can hook up to your case. So here you go. We got USB 3. We got two of them. On the back of the ports, we've got two USB 2.0s. But on board, you've got four USB ports. So you've got other options. And I believe it does come with a uh, connector in the back for you to... Um, well, it does not. I'm sorry. It doesn't come with a connector in the back for you to put more in the back. But your case will have two USB ports, so that gives you some extras. And you can always do a hub. Again, guys, this is the bare bones. Maybe your mom wants one, maybe your dad or something, uh, and you just want to build one. You've always talked about how you wanted to build one. This is the opportunity to do it. Some of the reviews. Uh, disregard the four-star review because of the component and compatibility. Uh, again, Asus is a good company, so they're going to definitely warranty their product. Uh, so that's not going to be a problem. He used a different version. He used the old Athlon 4X or X4, so that was one of the problems right there that gave bad scores same thing here again you got another compatibility issue but again they're using the Athlon X4 and that's not what we're using so you can't blame the motherboard for being bad if that's the problem so, um, so I, review wise it's a fairly good it, it's only $48 plus free shipping it comes with a rebate of $10 but I don't know about that and I'm sorry it's $199 for shipping alright memory so your motherboard has only got two memory slots. So this is again bare bones. Eight gigabytes, two four gigabytes, 240 pin, DDR3 at 1866. That's the best fa fastest speed you can get for this. I mean, yeah, you can push the buttons, but for the price you want it, it's $40, uh, free shipping. So this is definitely what you want. And you, you integrate this with your order of your uh, motherboard and your CPU, and so the shipping, you know, if you order enough items, they might even knock the shipping off. But then you get it from Newegg. Newegg's a good company. Uh, good reviews. Nothing bad about this one. Uh, 571 people all say good. So, and it looks cool. Not like you'll be able to see it with this cheap case that we're going to buy for it, though. All right, so uh, the hard drive. You want to look at hard drive? So we looked at the SSD. Uh, 160 gigabyte uh, SSD solid state drive. $64 plus it's free shipping from Amazon. Uh, the link will be in the description. You can't beat it. It's not going to be the fastest thing on the planet, but you can do your operating system on here and maybe one or two of your games that you like. Uh, that will help speed it up a little bit. So, and then we added a another hard drive, a one terabyte hard drive. Um, I'm sorry, I didn't give you the price. It is $64 plus shipping and handling is free. And then, so you have the Ultra Star one terabyte it's an enterprise hard drive, 24-7 uh, duty. How can you go wrong? It's going to be a little slow. Maybe it might be even a little loud, but we're not looking for something really quiet. We're looking at price. $40 for one terabyte, so all the videos can go on there uh, that you need. You can put all your pictures on there. And the thing about this hard drive, guys, it's an enterprise hard drive. It's going to take the beating that your kid, your mom, or maybe you are going to do with this. Uh, again, you're not spending a ton of money, so uh, free shipping with that. It's made by Hitachi. Uh, if you can say that three times real fast, you're the man. All right, for the case, we've got all those items. What are we going to put it in? So the Cool Master, Cooler Master. There, it's a good uh, company. They're somebody that you can definitely get customer support from. Again, this case here is $49.99. You get a $20 rebate. Now, the catch to this is. It's free shipping, but they're going to keep that $20 rebate. So realistically, it's $49.99, no matter how you look at it. So maybe you can pull it off with ordering all the other items from Amazon, or from um, Newegg, and you can get it for $49.99 with a $20 rebate, and then they don't charge you the shipping. So that's the way that works. A lot of people get excited and go, yeah, man, I get a... I get a, a case for $29.99 and $20 rebate and free shipping. Well, they get you in the drive-thru, as they say. Uh, keep in mind, this is a cheaper case, as you can see. Let's look at it. It comes with a lot of screws and cables. Uh, 
it has USB 3 on the front, but the motherboard that we're putting on there is not going to have USB 3 and the connectors. So that is going to limit your ability to put the USB 3. But now you can fix a USB 2 to that, and it's not a big deal. Your port will work. You've got four ports available that you can hook up, but your case has only got three. So you'll have three uh, on the case. And it has room for the DVD drive, which we've included in this. Um, again, a little picture there. So nothing spectacular. Uh, you're not going to have lights shining through it or anything. That's not what this case is all about. 228 reviews and four stars or four eggs on the 228 reviews. Let's look at what some of the reviews had to say. Um, decent case for low price. Decent quality for a great price. Nice case. Pretty basic. Great airflow and special. Uh, I'm not seeing anything. Um, nice understated looks. Fairly small size. Well, yeah. Only one USB 3 up front. I don't know why they did that. A waste. No room for routing cables behind the motherboard. Again, guys, you're paying for next to nothing on this case. What do you expect? So I don't, I don't qualify that as a disclaimer of this being a bad case for you. This guy says terrible. Looks okay. DVD drive collides with the motherboard. That could be a problem. Uh, it goes on to talk about the DVD drive is more than one inch short of going in and would have damaged components on the motherboard. That is a good complaint there. So that could be a problem. But he doesn't tell us what. He gives us what motherboard, but I'm not sure if the motherboard's designed for that case. Perfect for what I'm doing. Okay, enough of that. So keep in mind, again, $49.99 at uh, Newegg. Link will be in the description. Uh, so uh, nothing spectacular, uh, but it will get you started. All right, power supply. We need a power supply for our system, and our power supply is a Roswell Phantom 550. It's 550 watts, fully modular, and uh, you can get your cables through uh, um, mods if you want. You're not nobody's going to see these guys, so don't plan on doing that. You just want a reliable power supply. Somebody that if something goes wrong, you can return it and get it replaced. Uh, as you see, it comes with all these cables, so you got more than enough there. And again, it's sixty nine ninety nine. I know that's a lot. We could have went cheaper, but I don't like going cheaper on the power supply. All right. It's a fourth generation. It's ready. It's SLI and Crossfire ready. So you could, if you decide to upgrade, you could always use this on your new upgrade. So this is the one item that I was not willing to give too much. You do get a $10 rebate, but I wouldn't, um, wouldn't expect that, uh, to get that because they're going to take it out of the shipping. It's, it is free shipping on this. Um, but you'd probably get it in seven days, but $10 rebate. So you can pay $59.99 maybe. So, uh, you never know how well that's going to go. Again, that is your power supply. Good reviews. There are 14 reviews out of the 14. There's one negative. Let's go see if we can find the negative. And see, so works well, but uh, clean power. Cables are long enough. My fan is not silent, as indicated in the description. It's noticed to be loud, unlike any power supply I have ever owned. The fan seems to be spinning constantly. Ah, that could be a problem. So call Ross. We'll send it back and see if, you know, they've got good support, so take care of it. Uh, that one's good. Dead in 10 months. Uh, died in 10 months. That is not good. Uh, you definitely want to return it if you have that. Uh, for somebody that's been in computers for a long time, guys, let me tell you this. Uh, always don't hesitate to send an email with a serial number to the customer service of the item that you've got. You'll be amazed sometimes what I come up with it. Asus did that with a laptop I had. I had it for three years, and all of a sudden it just burned out. I sent them an email, and lo and behold, they've replaced it. No questions asked, and I didn't buy the extended warranty. That was their customer service. So, very, very happy. Bad fan. So, the fan could be a problem. This was in, uh, this was last year. Um, again, last year, fan, fan, DOA. So, uh, the fan could be a problem, but as of June of this year, it works well. So, uh, it's definitely what we recommend. Again, uh, they got good customer service. All right. DVD drive. How hard can a DVD drive be? Main thing is you want is the cheap shipping on it as you can do. Here we got it for 99 cents shipping. It's 19 or it's $20. So $21 you're getting a DVD RW uh, with all these extra little features. But a DVD drive is a DVD drive. Okay, there's nothing spectacular about it. Um, it's it's just going to work. It, it either works or it doesn't. 
light on has been around forever uh it's something you definitely can return especially if you get it from new egg not a problem all right so now we're going to go to the monitors and what i want to discuss about the monitors i picked two different companies because see new egg and amazon uh or new egg especially seem to have the the um i guess you would say the monopoly on this uh video tonight but i wanted to show you that another b and h has a monitor aoc monitor it's a 21.5 inch lcd uh five me me uh, milliseconds and it's 94 dollars and 99 cents that is with free shipping they do have it in stock now it got fairly good reviews there's only two reviews so you know what does that tell us nothing but guys keep this in mind this is a 1080p monitor nothing spectacular for you to write home about it is the basics okay um so we got customers got a picture there um it's the basics it's just to get you by to do some basic gaming you're not going to do no 4k this is a basic 1080p monitor all right now what i normally wouldn't do is have you two monitors to look at but here's the other one that we looked at now this is the acer g6 series it's a 21.5 inch 5 millisecond lcd led uh lcd monitor led backlit all the big terms you know people use it's a nice monitor okay it is uh one of the uh nicer monitors it has good reviews 129 with it's 189.99 and it's got 99 cents shipping so it's basically 91 dollars. and the other one is 94 95 dollars free shipping they're both the same monitor basically so you pick which one you want you're already ordering all this other stuff from new egg so why not just go with this and add it into the stack what i would suggest you do is make a look i am only going to put the uh new egg description link in the description i want to go with one i don't want to confuse you if you're a first time watcher and you're like hey i think i want to build my own system this is the way i want to go this is you know it's not cheap by any means but it's cheaper and it gives me a kind of a, a foot in the door it's for my kid for my mom for my dad uh maybe my aunt or uncle grandparents whoever my grandparents you know you're 14 15 years old trying to convince your mom to let you buy all these parts to build a system for them this is the way to do it and so to make things just keep things simple i wanted you guys to see the other monitor but if i had to give you a suggestion I w we're going for price so we're going to go for the cheaper price and it's the 89.99 i just didn't want you guys to think that there's not other options there are other options out there so let's definitely do it so i'm gonna take that out of there all right so there you go for five hundred and fifty dollars you get this now guys you're not gonna be able to play gta 5 at max settings you're gonna have to have everything on low settings to play gta 5 and probably 720 uh in 1080 you're definitely gonna have to have it low but there are other games out there that you can play older games you can still do adobe premiere you can still do these other things it's just not going to be as fast i know there's videos out there and we're going to do a video of the system that you you know the mid system the high system we're going to mix them up change them up and all that and we're going to do a daily deal where every day there is a deal that we're going to find for you and we're going to give you hey today is cpu day here's the deal of the cpu go out there and find it and you can get it you know we'll we'll do the research and all as time goes by we're going to build these systems we're going to video build on them and then when we get a thousand subscribers what we'll do is we'll push out one of the systems we build uh that you guys so for the next video tell me what what system you want do you want a mid high end uh maybe you want one for just editing audio all you're going to do is edit audio so what's more important for that than a processor or a video card it's a sound system the sound card or maybe i'm just going to record sound or maybe i need one for a camera system at my house the different options they're unlimited let us know and we'll go out here we'll tell you what to build and then the next step is we'll eventually show you how to build it so let us know subscribe tell us what you want to see uh if you liked it or you didn't like it uh you know it ain't nothing like telling us to go pound sand i don't mind pounding some sand i'll i'll go i'll get it better or that doesn't sound right does it Ugh, that sounds awful um so just tell us to do <laughs> right or not so uh just let us know um again i'm sitting here talking while we're looking at a blank screen it's not moving around i guess we could have looked at reviews while we were doing this worth the price cheap 
Very limited viewing angle. Hey, I don't know about you guys, but if you're standing over at the kitchen trying to look at your computer doing something from 20 feet away at a 90 degree angle, you probably don't need this monitor anyway. So, uh, just let me know. Worst picture, then it died. Oh, that's not good. So, uh, and that was, well, it was just a couple months ago. So, today's date is August 29th, 2016. So, all these parts are in stock. That was one of the uh, things we did. If it wasn't in stock, we didn't, we wouldn't review it. And also, again, keep in mind that your connector for your, let's see, let's zoom this in for you. This is going to be one of the, the DVI is what I would suggest you connect your monitor to. The uh, But you do have VGA available if need be uh, for your motherboard. And it, again, this is on board graphics. Okay. You can always upgrade that. This is a system that you can upgrade. And you can buy your video card for another $100. But that's not the design of this system. Okay. All right. And again, for $550, it does not include the operating system. Go out there and do your research for Windows 10. You might already have a license for Windows 10 or Windows uh, 8 or 7 that you have that you can do the upgrade to Windows 10. I don't, that's something that you will unfortunately have to figure out because there's just too many unknowns there for me to suggest where you go to get it. But Windows 10, you can order it from any of these places. If you buy the $120 version, remember that is your license for life, so you don't have to worry about somebody scamming you, paying $20 for a license key that you can do at some websites out here. So I always suggest go the safe way if you can. But some of you are going to be desperate. So, uh, But I just can't tell you what Hey, subscribe, like, 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 like